guys for a Symphona Commvault tutorial today I'll be uh, showing uh, what are the different uh, Commvault services we have that are running on master server along with it I'll show you uh, the dependencies and also how to restart Commvault services in a right way so to check uh, the Commvault services go to uh, services.msc on the master server okay so uh, these are the uh, various uh, Commvault services we have application manager client event manager commands manager communication service HMS recaller job manager media and library manager media mount manager reporting service event manager vss provider service workflow engine and also we have if you scroll down a little bit you'll see an sql instance sql commvault server sql server agent okay if you go back here this event manager is nothing but it will uh, forward all the events generated to the com to the com cell that's in case, for example, let's say there is a job failure and uh, it will generate an event under the Windows Event Viewer log. So this event manager service will capture that event and will forward to the comm cell. Okay. And the communication service is nothing but it takes care of the all the uh, communication between the comm server and uh, the clients and media agent. And the job manager is, is take it control the running jobs and about the resources so this is very important service for comser functionality media and library manager is nothing but responsible for all hardware devices that are part of console like uh, your library tape libraries your sand drives your nas drives that are connected to the master server media mount manager service is is will interact with the devices the same the library your NAS, your SAND drive, your virtual tape libraries, okay? It will ensure that they are up and running online. So the event manager, okay, the server event manager is nothing but, uh, it will also keep a track of events that have generated on the clients, Your that is your, uh, what you're backing up, your clients and also your media agent server. And VSS provider service is nothing but, it use your native, VSS writers okay and uh, if you go back here for um, your SQL server combo is nothing but it, it keeps in the background it maintains your configuration the storage the processing and data and everything all right so these are the the important services so how you will restart uh, these services I mean it is not recommended to restart the services manually from uh, services.msc i mean because you should know the order because there are dependencies if you look at the dependencies see so these so each and every service is dependent upon the other service so you need to be very careful while restarting these services so for that what you have to do is you have to go to the uh, the installation folder where exactly you install the Commvault Symphona. Under that, you have to go to the base folder, and here you have something called GX Admin. GX Admin. Exe. Double click on it. You'll see a pop-up window with the Process Manager. It will show all the services here. Okay. So if you want to restart the base services. Just highlight that one and just click on this. It will ask, do you want to restart the service? And if you want to restart the CompServe services, you can do the same thing. If you want to restart the MediaDen service, you can do the same thing. So this is the right way to stop and restart the services. Okay. So guys, uh, I'll be covering about uh, the log files, the detail log files in my next tutorial. So stay tuned for more tutorial guys. Thank you so much for watching and have a nice day.